Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here then hi, my name's Cohen. Thank you so much for joining me. So today's video is going to be a sort of new in haul, collective haul. It's basically bits that I've been picking up over the past couple of weeks, maybe a month. Um, so it's got a couple of brands in here. Um, this is a bit of a different setup. I thought I would try and stand up and you know do something a little bit different this time um, and it's so much easier as well because I've bought this rail um, from Ikea I'll link it down below it's just like a lifesaver um, and I think yeah it's just so much easier to do it this way than sat down so I, I went online um, what else, where else did I go? I went shopping with uh, my friend and her daughter and picked some things up. Um, and yeah, so without further ado, let's get into this video. The first thing that I picked up was, well actually it was two things I picked up from an app. It's called Macari. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people have already heard of this app. It's very similar to your sort of Depop's. Um, and things like that where you can obviously resell your clothes um, but what I like about it, it's got a lot of sort of bloggers on there and obviously as many people will know bloggers and YouTubers they often get sent clothes and items that they might not always wear um, you know all the time um, or they might not get as much use out of so they put them on there and the items are actually really well looked after you know they've either not been worn or hardly worn um, and yeah the good thing is that I like about this app is that when you sell your items you basically get the money into the balance on the app rather than into your account you can get it into your account if you want to but I find it better not to because it means that I can actually go and buy clothes off that app and I don't feel as guilty about it because I never had it in my account. I was searching for um, a nice black coat, that's what I wanted, I've, but like a winter black coat. I've got like a blazer um, coat, I've got like a parker coat, both in black, but I wanted um, a nice black coat that I could chuck on when I'm going out on the weekend and it doesn't sort of take away from um, your outfit. So I'm really happy that I came across this black coat. It's like this black faux fur coat and um, it's from New Look and I got it in a size 8. Well this was in a size 8 um, and when this came it actually already it had the tags and everything on it so I don't think it had been worn um, and yeah it's, it was in great condition obviously. It is the softest material ever and I, do you know what I just think if you know if you're wearing obviously it's party season coming up so if you're wearing like a really nice dress and you know it's freezing outside and you don't want to take away from your outfit then I think something putting something like this over the top you know is really nice I've been wearing this to death now like I kind of I've wet I feel like I should stop wearing it because it is a really nice coat so I'm like wearing it for work and I just think it's just maybe just to save it a little bit more but yeah I'm I really love this one I do have something else from the app Macari but I will show that um, a little later in the video because that's um, boots and I want to sort of show your shoes together so quickly moving on to pretty little thing I went on there and I placed an order um, and I got this top that I'm wearing now um, I said in one of my videos that I really want to be sort of like trying to buy some more animal prints I only had I think I only had the trousers and I wanted some more and um, so I bought this from Pretty Little Thing it's it's just a normal sort of basic tea material and then obviously it's got your snake print um, and is it is sort of um, it's I thought it was going to be a lot tighter than it is, but it's not. It's it's more like of a loose t-shirt. Um, but yeah, I again, I like the print. I think the print's really nice. The fact that it's got like um, you sort of more of a beigey effect on it because I think it goes nice with like other nudes. Um, and I actually bought these trousers, and I thought that they might go really well with it. I picked up these nude culottes. Um, again, these are in that sort of jersey material. Um, I've actually I've got. A couple of pairs but I've got them in like black I've got them in purple and I don't have any um, in the sort of nude color and I think um, these are really nice I think they'll go with anything so I, I don't think I'll be wearing many dresses and skirts and things like that because I'm an actual wimp when it comes to the cold so I thought you know pick something up that's basic plain and you can sort of dress it up however you want whether you want to wear a nice body with it or you know if you just wanted to wear it more casually um, like this if you just wanted to put 
this with this top and maybe some white um, chunky trainers. I think that would also look nice as well. Um, but yeah, I've not tried these on yet. I will try them on in the clip. Um, I've got a feeling they might be a little bit see-through. Um, but I guess we'll see. <laughs> I am so, so late to this trend and th no, I'm just so late that I can't even wear them yet because it's too cold. Um, I've basically picked up some cycling shorts. Everybody and their mom knows what cycling shorts look like, what they're like. I love how many, you know, I loved like over the summer people wearing them and I just was like, I just wasn't sure if there was me, but I thought, do you know what? I think Pretty Little Thing had like a sale on, I think they had like 20% off, so I thought, you know what, I'm just going to pick some, I'm just going to pick some up and I'm going to see how they look, um, I've not tried these ones on yet, but even though I can't wear them outside because I will literally freeze to death, um, I thought they might be quite nice for working out, um, if I can't wear them and then, you know, if I do like them, I can pick some more up whenever because they're, they're so cheap anyway, um, I love the different styles that they come in and I also, I'm obsessed the way, um, that they're being styled up at the moment so with your oversized blazer um buttoned up and with the oversized blazer that's buttoned um sort of like buttoned up um and then these sort of like popping out at the at the bottom obviously <laughs> um but yeah i think it's a little bit cold for me to to wear them outside but i definitely am going to give them a try see how they feel um might work in, work out in these and then you know if i do really like them i definitely think i hope that they come back in the summer Fingers crossed. Moving on to shoes. I will start with the ones that I picked up from Macari again. I've been after some white boots for so long, but trying to find the white boots, perfect white boots is actually quite difficult. And then finding the sort of like right heel and everything. I don't know, maybe I'm just way too picky with them, but I stumbled across these ones um, on the app and I thought I've got to pick these up. Um, and they're just these white, um, block heel boots i'm i love block heel i'm just a big fan of them i think because you can sort of wear them throughout the day um and you know it doesn't look too dressed up and obviously you can actually walk around with them in the day and they don't hurt your feet too much um but yeah i, I really really like these ones um they're just basically you're so basic they're just plain white shoes but yeah i'm so glad i picked these up um and they do go really nicely with like this top um what did I wear them with the other day I think as well you you know if you're wearing like maybe an all black outfit and then you pop these on um teddy bear coat which I've shown in a previous haul um I think it just it's nice to add a little bit of you know I love that black and white contrast so yeah I'm really glad that I picked these up like I said earlier, I went into Primark, nipped into Primark when I went out, and obviously, and <laughs> I said that I was going to pick up animal print, some more animal print, but I think I'm actually getting a bit too obsessed and just need to calm down. Um, I bought these from Primark, and I've not worn these yet actually, um, but I thought there was just such a bargain. I've seen so many people with these, not these particular ones, but different sort of snake print boots, and I was like, I have to get some because. You know, I'm I'm not like um so I love the the animal print. But I'm not really gonna wear like animal print on animal print on animal print. I'm probably just gonna wear one or two items. Uh, so I wouldn't necessarily wear these together. But I think, like I say, if you've got like a nice old black outfit, a nice white jumper or cream jumper, and then you put these on, I think they'll look really nice. Um, but yeah, there was there were I just I think because of the price, I can't remember how much they were. They were only sixteen pounds and. If you go on sort of ASOS or anything like that, I think they're probably more about thirty, forty pounds to get a nice pair of snake print boots. And I just saw these and I thought, you know, they they're just really cute. If you can see them. Um, but yeah, obviously, I think I'm becoming a little bit obsessed with snake print. I think I need to calm down because I actually do have more snake print coming. Finally, what I picked up from Primark, and I think anybody that goes to Primark, nine times out of ten, is probably going to pick up some flat ballet pumps, and that's exactly what I did. Wrong way. <laughs> that's exactly what I did. Um, I work in an office, so I go through black flat shoes like no tomorrow. Literally, I must buy like at least a pair a month. Um, so yeah, I picked these up, and I really like... I don't know what this shape is called, 
is it like an oval shape? I know I've seen quite a few heels like this as well and I would love to get some. Um, but I really like these this sort, um, this sort of shape and style of the shoe. Um, but yeah, I've, these will come in very handy. Just basic flat pump. The only thing that I would say is if you do go into Primark and pick these up, I'd probably size up because, because the front is so narrow the back is, uh, it like can rub on you a little bit, so I, I picked up a size 5, which I usually am, and maybe I should have picked up a 6, maybe, but they're not too bad, I think, you know, I'll wear them in, and like I say, they'll probably be done in a month after <laughs> wearing them every day for work, so, yeah. Okay guys, that is it for today's video, um, I really hope that you enjoyed it, I know it's a little bit of a different sort of setup. let me know if you like it in the comments below, um, let me know which item you like below, and let me also, if you've been on the app Macari, let me know what your thoughts are, because I love it, and I, you know, if you go on it, let me know what you think of it. Um, don't forget to leave any suggestions for future videos. Um, I'm ma making sure that I'm filming every single weekend. And I really, really, really want to get out two videos a week and become a little bit more consistent. Um, so yeah, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.